G'day, he's gone. Out at the dam. Looking at rocks. What a surprise. Found some cool stuff to show you. All the way it's been contorted. And I say it's, you look at this, you can pretty much say that's the oldest and it's like, it's like growth rings in a tree and that's the youngest. And you can always easily pick an intrusive rock because if it goes through those different time periods, that means it's came into this, which I say most quartz is. But I actually found the very, very edge of where it joins siltstone to granite. And it's right on the edge of the dam. And I say all. All of the, the waters and the, that were in the ground very close to this got superheated. And if you look at the bands, they vanish. That's because all of that got cooked. This stuff came up and, and um, solidified and formed quartz. But it was that hot that it actually cooked the siltstone and, and altered it. So it's back to it there. Got super hot and back to normal there. So, just over there, we're going to walk over. I found the very, very edge. So, one side you've got all your, your sedimentaries, and on the other side you've got all your granite. And granodites. Another thing I found... Is I believe I'm not 100% certain. Um, I believe I've actually found a bit of solidified lava. So it's erupted out of a volcano and solidified on the ground. And I believe that's what I've found a little bit of that. But when I get over here, I'll, I'll pick it up and we'll have a look at it. And you can figure out whether you reckon I'm right or wrong. Yeah. I just, I'm not a fan of this, eh? I'm not going to go on about it for too long, but I'm just going to highlight once again. If you can't take this stuff with you when you come out camping, don't go camping. Gee, I hope I sleep well tonight. <laughs> Nothing too strenuous, but for someone that doesn't do anywhere near the amount of physical work and, and activities that I used to do, the little bit of walking I do now, like doing videos for you guys, takes it out of me. But I don't mind. I still enjoy it. Again, whoever you are, don't come out here. Don't go, don't go anywhere. Just stay in your own house. Wild water. Getting close to the edge. So I'll start blabbering on about rocks. Because I know everybody's super excited about talking about rocks. Rocks.
What do you notice there? Look at the direction of that, and then look at the direction of that. So this stuff, you know, it's got all, it had organic matter in it. The time period would lend to the fact that there would not be a great deal of plant life around. Organisms living in water? Yes. So, we're now getting very, very close to the edge of that bubble of granite that came up in the ground. And if you've got a molten ball of magma that's coming up in the ground, what do you think it's going to do to the ground it touches? It's going to cook it. And it did. It cooked it real good. See some of the bands there. Still recognizable, but the color is completely different. You can see the edge of it there. And the more you go over this way, the closer you start getting back to your granite. Oh. That's back into your granite again there. That's how... That's the very, very edge of that granite bubble that was coming up in the ground and that's where it was actually contacting the sedimentary stone alrighty Whew. All right. time for me to go home it's a nice spot out here it's just a shame that people come out and make it messy. Anywho. Yeah. All right. Hope you find some yellow. I washed a couple of pans in the creek on the way in. Zero. Because there's lots of granite around, got lots of black sand. Oodles. And if Paula, you're listening, you love the word oodles. Oodles and oodles of mica. Yeah, I can see me pile of rocks where I've got me, me species. Paulie, the first time I said oodles or something, you looked at me and went, what? I said oodles, lots, heaps. And then he never stopped. Everything had oodles of it. <laughs> funny guy. Funny, funny guy. Your eyes are the best, pros best prospecting tool you've got in your whole toolkit. Walk onto a stream, walk onto a river, spend 15, 20, half an hour just walking around looking. Right. Now, 
I believe this bit here. We've got some light anywhere here. I believe that. A bit of solidified lava. You can see melted stone in it. Little spheres. Another sphere there. Sure that that's going to be mag in there. <laughs> Lots of um, greys, blacks, greens, blues. Oh, not so much blues, but different colours in the, the quartz. <laughs> Another couple of my species I'm taking aim. By the way, that's been contorted and bent. And then this one's even cooler. It went up, down, up, down. Don't know about that. Need to cook it and crush it and see what's in it. Anywho. Get out there, get into it. Until the next video, I'll catch us later. Bye.